Welcome. By the end of this video, you'll be able to cancel your MuseScore free trial subscription. This works mainly for those who have a subscription for MuseScore Pro. Maybe you tried out the free trial and I'll show you how to cancel that by the end of this video. Let's get started. So to start, you're going to want to go to MuseScore.org and then you're going to want to go up to the top right hand corner and then log in to the account you created for your free trial. And it will ask for your username and your password. So once you complete that step, it will take you to the screen and say that you have been logged in. You'll go up to the right-hand corner again, and then uh, you want to drop down uh, the arrow here, and then you want to go to settings. And once you're in settings, you want to go to the left-hand side of your screen, and then you want to click on subscription. So once you click on the subscription tab there, you're going to come to this page, and it will tell you the status of your Musco Pro subscription. So you can see mine is active currently, and I have a free trial until December 10th. And so I, I'm within that free trial period, so I can still end the trial. And then it tells me that the, the paid annual subscription will start after my free trial. So I'd like to cancel this before that paid annual subscription starts. So you're going to scroll down and it's kind of in a funny spot here, but actually it's right here where it says uh, end my free benefits. So you're going to scroll down a little bit and then you're going to want to uh, click on end my free benefits. And then once you click on that, it's going to take you to this screen where it says uh, your free trial will be canceled and the pro features will not be available. Uh, if you have any questions, you can go to uh, that email. So once you've reviewed everything and you're sure that you want to cancel the subscription, uh, you just click on I do not want my benefits. Okay, and then it'll bring you to this page. You can scroll to the top of the page and you can see the subscription now is saying that I am inactive. So I no longer have MuseScore Pro. So that's one thing to keep in mind. Once you decide to end your subscription, your free trial, your benefits will end uh, right away. So it's not like some other services where you'll actually have till the end of the free trial to keep your benefits. Uh, this one, whenever it seems like whenever you click that button, it is going to cancel your benefits immediately. So something to keep in mind uh, if you want to uh, maybe stretch out a couple of the days that you have the free trial left if you want to take advantage of some of the things that MuseScore has to offer, MuseScore Pro. And then again, if you want to uh, restart your membership, you can then uh, click on this and it will take you through uh, the prompts again to do that. But again, the main place that you find this is go up to the tab, go to settings, and then the, the tab on the left hand, the subscription, that's where you're going to find uh, where to be able to uh, change your subscription status. One thing to keep in mind, the main benefits of MuseScore Pro are there are uh, many scores uh, of sheet music that are available to you in MuseScore Pro that are not available in the basic version. And the way you can tell that is if you search for a piece of music and it has that uh, the small symbol of Pro next to it, that means that uh, MuseScore Pro members uh, have access to that sheet music uh, to be able to use for what you would like to use it for. So now you know how to cancel your free trial subscription to MuseScore. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments section below. I do my best to answer those. I have other MuseScore tutorials available. I'll put links to them around this video. If you enjoyed this, please like and subscribe. I thank you and I'll see you in the next video.